Good morning, Coach Slack here once again, continuing our readings on the Synaxarian, the lives of the saints of the Orthodox Church. On this, the 21st day of August, we celebrate the memory of the Holy Apostle Thaddeus. The Holy Apostle Thaddeus, sometimes also called Levi, came from the town of Edessa in Orson, of a Jewish family from which he received an excellent knowledge of the Holy Scriptures. He went on to pilgrimage to Jerusalem and, having heard St. John the Baptist preaching repentance and being filled with enthusiasm for his angelic way of life, he was baptized by him. Sometime later, he met the Lord Jesus Christ. The amazing miracles that he wrought in his sublime teaching gave Thaddeus the conviction that he was the Savior, proclaimed both by John and the prophets, and so he joined his disciples and followed Jesus right up to his life-giving passion. <clears throat> in conformity with the promise that the Lord had given King Agabar, who had asked him to go and heal him after the ascension, he sent Thaddeus to Edessa to baptize the king and completely heal him of his leprosy. The zealous apostle catechized and baptized many more of the people of the kingdom, which was the first state to declare itself Christian. He had many churches built there, and then went on <clears throat> with his mission and proclaimed the good news in other towns in Syria, and some say in Mesopotamia. Arriving in Berthus in Phoenicia, he baptized a great many pagans there before giving his soul into God's hands in peace, receiving the recompense of the faithful servant of his grace, St. Thaddeus's relics were translated to Constantinople, together with those of the Apostle Andrew <clears throat> by St. Artemius in 337. There was also an icon uh, during the reading from the Monastery of Dionysio on Mount Athos from the 17th century. <clears throat> Through the prayers of thy saints, Lord Jesus Christ, have mercy upon us. Amen. <clears throat>